everybody, it's your crazy fangirl Shine. We hope you guys are having an amazing day. Happy Monday, everybody. And it is the release of the second episode of The Last of Us. Super, super excited to watch this, guys. As you guys already know, I absolutely loved the first episode. The whole internet loved the first episode. I think I got, like, 20 million views or something in the first few days. Like, insanity. Well, of course, we're probably going to get a season two, which I'm already excited about, especially even though it's very controversial because of part two. But anyway, part one was so good. Or oh, episode one, sorry. <laughs> and I just, yeah, I feel like the, like, Pedro... Uh, Bella, everybody just suits the characters so well. Um, especially the ones who aren't obviously from the original, as I said last time. Marlene is from the original game. And just, yeah, Bella and Pedro just have such, like, already this, like, that chemistry that is very unique. And I just, I love how they've worked together so far. Already in episode one. Going in blind, I have no idea what's going on. I've avoided Twitter all day. Um, except to thank everybody, also wanted to do it in this video, for the insane support this past week like since last monday to now we've already reached 830 subscribers like what the hell like how did that happen and also not only that just the support on these videos already like you guys show up and just do work hard and i'm just like what the hell guys like can you not because i'm just sitting here crying in a corner like Oh, like that, it means the world. Like I don't try and focus on that, but to see people watching my videos and just enjoying them, it makes me so happy. And I'm happy that I'm able to bring that content to you guys. So yeah, we're gonna jump straight into, into this reaction. So please remember to like, subscribe and comment if you enjoyed this video, but also to keep up to date with all my other reactions to more TV shows, movies and video games. So without further ado, let's jump straight into this. Hmm. I'm guessing this has something to do with like the cordyceps and stuff, like the infection. Tapi kenapa menggunakan klorasol untuk mempersiapkan slide? Kami gunakan sebagai persiapan pengambilan sampel dari tubuh manusia, bukan? Oh. Oh, so the person was shot. I want to know about what happened to the person. Yeah. Yep, nope, nope. We're not the. Uh... Apa ini kita manusia? Oh, so people had s started very early on. They just didn't do anything about it. Is that. Nope. No, thank you. Uh... God, so it was growing. It's already growing out of him. Even though he's dead. Oh my god. Seorang perempuan yang tiba-tiba melakukan kekerasan, menyerang empat orang rekan kerja dan menggigit tiga orang di antaranya. Mereka kemudian mengunci oh, perempuan itu. Oh shit. Pekerja yang lain bagaimana? Empat belas orang hilang. <gasps> Kami butuh vaksin. Butuh obat. Vaksin, oh my god. What? Oh Jesus. Bom seluruh kota. Dan seluruh orang yang ada di dalamnya. Jesus freaking Christ. Yeah, cuz she knows how bad it is. There's no cure. Maaf, There's nothing they can do. It's full on. Oh, Ellie. My darling. Beautiful. Oh yeah, I forgot Neil Druckmann, who is the director of the game, directing this episode too. Pretty sick. Oh, gee. Oh my god, they're just staring at her. <laughs> You're out of few minutes. There's not going to be anything bad in here? Just you. No. <laughs> <laughs> scanner. No killer. Well, better than than us. We need to stop talking about this kid like she's got some kind of life in front of her. Oof. Oof. There's a firefly base camp somewhere else. The doctors. Vaccines, miracle cures, none of it works. Ever. Fuck you, man. I didn't ask for this. You and me. Come on, Joel. Let's just finish it. It doesn't matter if she is or she isn't with the Firefly say If they believe that she is, then we get what we want. If she so much as twitches, we it. Well, Joel's just like, I want to shoot this kid. <laughs> Whoa. 
They pumped so much money into this show. <laughs> it's good though. It looks amazing. It looks like so much like the game. Oh. So they did bomb everywhere. That's interesting. I'm guessing it happened like after the big breakout though. State house. Wanted to see what it was like. Didn't think there was going to be anything in there and then it just came at me out of nowhere. It's just you in there alone? Yeah. Ellie! Oh, I'm glad she's getting along with Tess. That's lovely. Because I know Joel's a bit of a hothead right now, but... It's crazy. I just swarms are infected running around everywhere. It's not exactly like that. You know, people like to tell stories. So there aren't super infected, they just load fungus spores on you? <laughs> Shit, I hope. <laughs> I, I don't know how to swim. Seriously? Do you think we have pools in the jacuzzi? No, smart ass. <laughs> wow, I'm supposed to smell that. <laughs> oh, both of them, I swear. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just gonna stop there, like, I already love this moment just because, like, uh, like, I didn't expect that we'd get such amazing moments like this because it's like, this is like the game where, like, literally you'll go, I mean, if people haven't played the video game, let me explain. So, basically, you'll go up to, like, example, Ellie does go up to a desk like this in the game. I can't remember exactly if Ellie does this, like, the word for word, but I remember that she does go up to a hotel desk and she does ask Joel, like, oh, have you been to a place like this? And she starts, like, talking about it. No, I feel like that's so beautiful that they actually put that in. I feel like that's because Neil is the visionary behind this as well. So he's, you know, like, he is apart from the game. Yeah, these quiet moments with Tess and Joel, I really, really like it. But also... Like, I like how, like, we're immediately reminded that, oh shit, like, this is not, like, the world before, or it's not all peaceful. Ah, oh, you gotta survive. Like, this is, this is your life now. Like, it's sad, but I absolutely love it. Last knife. Where'd you learn to do that? Circus. <laughs> <laughs> At least he's trying. <laughs> How long do infected live? Well, I thought you went to school. It's <sighs> really <sighs> hard. I swear. Is it hard? Like, you know, when they were people? It's... Sometimes. Last night. Oh. Damn! I want him to tell! Oh, wow. Oh. Ooh. Looks like fungus, too. I'm gonna patch up the sense in one place. And you can wake a dozen infected from somewhere else. Jesus. Where you are, now they come. Yeah, because it's all connected. Fuck, dude! Well, that's recent. What would you hear? Oh, <laughs> even I'm just like Shelly. Okay, from this point forward, we are silent, not quiet. Threat. Well, no question. Oof. Silence, everyone. Be quiet. Oh. oh. Those old bodies on the right corner of that staircase? Yes, it is. Oh! oh! She stepped on the hand! That is so gross. Oh, God. Sorry if my face looks weird right now. <laughs> Hey!
Just like the video game. Something happens. <gasps> For those who don't know what these are, these are what we call clickers, and they're one of the worst in The Last of Us floor. That's such a good shot. Oh god. Do not drop a bullet, John. Do not drop a bullet. <gasps> they look so good, but so horrible. the game i need to bloody breathe on that <laughs> that was so fantastic i again like i've played the game so many times and those things scared the living life out of me like i can't stand them at all like literally like that was my one worry because i was like please don't do cgi like it would be so wrong if they did and that makeup they better win some freaking awards this year because holy shit dude that was Perfection. So anyway, let's continue. The kid. Give me the first bite you take. The second. Can I just take the good news? Can you do that? Oh. Joel, little anxious bean. I know why, but still. Oh. Get everything you hope for. Oh. Jerry's still out. But man, you can't deny that view. That. Oh my god. I'll talk about it later because otherwise I'll cry. Come on. I don't know. They went inside. Yes. Come on. Yes. One of them's got to have a map on them. Ray? Joe, can you help me? No, it's over. We are going home. This is not my fucking home! The luck had to run out sooner or later. He's infected. Oh. Show me. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. No. <laughs> oh. This is real. This is fucking real. I need you to get her. Ask you for anything, not to feel the way I felt, not to make you shut the fuck up because I don't have time. This is your chance. Please say yes, Joe. Please. Oh, fuck! <laughs> Sick. I love that actually. I like that touch that they've added. Oh my god, they're all coming. Oh, the 
this is even worse than the game. Oh. Oh, Joel. God, why did they make it worse than it was in the game? Oh my god. I can't, like, again, like, it's gotten even better. Um, and just this episode alone was just so good, because we were introduced, obviously, to the clickers, who are some of the most dangerous in the lore of The Last of Us universe, like I said before, when I was having a panic attack. And just, we also got to get to know our characters a little bit more, especially, like, Joel a little bit, well, Joel, we've already known, but more Tess and Ellie. Um, we got to see a few more details about them, but also just, like, get to know them a bit more in terms of, like, what their attitude is like. I will admit, I do like t Tess in the show. I feel like she was a lot more hardcore in the game, which is fine. But, yeah, she, she was interesting in the game, too. But I did like her in the game as well, but just, I don't know, there's something about this one. The actress is so perfect. The, I, she's really tough because she's, like... This is how we're going to survive. You need to know these details. So concentrate. But also, I don't know, this a kindness towards her too. And just, I, that final part. Let's talk about that. I was going to hold off on that. But her death, she, in the game, it's very different. In the game, she gets shot by Fedra um, from the top of my head. In the game, you don't actually see her die. You hear the gunshot and then you see like distantly very far away you see her body on the ground. And it's like, oh, okay, yeah. I did cry when she died in the game. But, um, she is not she does not explode, which was even worse. But also the fact that, I don't know, there's something about that extra detail about the cordyceps. Like, I don't know if that's what happens in the game. I don't think it does. But, like, seeing how, like, the cordyceps and, like, the fungus just grows and then you see in another location and then just all of them running like that is so cool, that detail. I love that even more. Um, and then also just the fungus transferring from them to her. And I feel like a lot of people are going to be like, why was she like making out with a zombie? But I remembered immediately when that happened because I was like, oh, but then I was like, wait. And it, I remembered like in the first episode where that scientist at the beginning, he says, the cordyceps wants control. It will control its host. So I was like, it makes sense. She was not only frozen in fear, but also she was probably being controlled by the cordyceps to get, to stand there and intake more of that, like, control, I guess. And just, it's very interesting. I like that scientific part that sort of comes into play with that. But also, I felt like it was also meaningful. Like, it wasn't a kiss. It was more like she's basically given death. Like, it's like the kiss of death, basically. So I, I don't know. I like it a lot. And it's a lot more terrible than the game because it's still this one is so much more sad because she's basically in the middle of being turned into like an infected and then she she and I like how she takes it into her hands and she takes the blow in a way I don't know there's something more beautiful about that or sad I guess bittersweet not beautiful I don't know why I said that but it's more bittersweet and also just oh like Pedro also in that moment because like in the game it's one of my favorite moments just because Troy Bacon delivers in that moment. But in this, but Pedro obviously delivered. He's an incredible actor. And just the way he, oh, the hurt in his voice and also just like, the way he just looked at her just so intensely, just like, I feel like, like, it felt like from his expression, it felt like there was so many things going through his head. Like, oh, like there's so many things he regrets, I think, because it just looked like he had a lot of regret. And then just he drags Ellie out of the room, just, Oh, that's so heartbreaking. And then also Bella's performance throughout this whole episode was phenomenal. I absolutely love it. She, for sure, for sure she has to be nominated for something. I swear to God if she isn't, I'm going to be pissed. Because she, also, a lot of people are agreeing with me, which is nice. Because, like, she sounds like Ashley. Ashley Johnson, like I said previously, she's actor of Ellie, the original Ellie. Um, and just, she sounds like her too and acts exactly like her, which is so scary. It's like, holy shit, she's actually perfect. Like, But yeah, she was phenomenal. I loved her in the part with the clickers, especially because she's like, what happened? And then they're all like, shh, like, shut up. And even me, I was like, shut up, Ellie, you can't say anything. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up right now. <laughs> And then, yeah, just her seeing them for the first time, she's staring at them, like, perfect. And just also, again, the clickers, like, they were 
perfect. Oh my god. And then it was so tense. I love how, it, especially it's exactly like the game where you go into a zone and then you're like, oh fuck. Like, oh god. Like, there's something here. And this was perfect. This, it just... <sighs> I wish the episodes were longer. <laughs> this is the one time I wish, like, this is this and Andor is the times where I wish I could binge it. I don't know, because it's just like, I want more! It's just so good. And just, yeah. All the performances were amazing. I really wish we had more time with Tess, but I knew this was coming. Either this episode or the next episode, but... Uh, she was so good. And so thank you guys so much for watching this reaction. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give a like, subscribe, comment, and tell me your thoughts on this episode of episode two, Last of Us. Um, yeah, tell me your thoughts because this was a great episode. Also, just to sort of finish it off, they were talking about seeing Bill, um, which I'm really excited about um, because Bill is that that section of the game is one of my favorites. He's one of my favorite characters. Um, so I am excited. I can't wait. It's gonna be so good. <laughs> so again, thank you guys so much for watching this, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Casey Bingo out. Woo!